We describe our research as the FedEx of drug delivery and cell delivery because just like FedEx, we're working on the packaging. And then we collaborate very closely with neuroscientists, cancer biologists, in terms of what's going inside that packaging. And just like FedEx, we need to get our, our, our materials, what's inside of that packaging, to the right place and at the right time. So in the context of stroke, for example, one of our areas of interest is on stimulating the endogenous stem cells that are resident in the brain. Until the early 1990s, we didn't actually think the brain had the capacity to regenerate. Now we know that the brain does have the capacity to regenerate, but it won't do it on its own. So what we're doing is looking to find those factors that will stimulate those stem cells that are resident in our brain to promote tissue regeneration and functional recovery after stroke. So what we're doing then is, uh, it's really difficult actually to access those stem cells in our brain. What we have to do is figure out a way to get across what's called the blood-brain barrier. And so it turns out that the blood vessels in our brains are really form the, the endothelial cells from these really tight junctions. So most molecules that we will take orally or by intravenous injection won't actually get into the brain. So then what we're doing is figuring out a way to get across that blood-brain barrier, kind of going around that barrier and delivering those molecules directly to the brain to stimulate those resident stem cells.